Hi, my name is Albert. As a Christian family doctor, to bring healing to my patients has always been my passion. Thanks to HKSSM, I'm experiencing healing encounters from Father God to me and to my patients in amazing ways. In my very first class with HKSSM, one member of the senior class picked me out from 78 other year one students to prophesy over me. He said that I would be like Abraham, fathering many, including those who are older and younger than me. This prophetic word had the greatest impact on me. Before this, it was natural for me to embrace younger people, but I have fear towards people older than me. But ever since that prophecy, there have been many times when I pray for older people, my father's heart on them becomes so strong, they just cry like babies. Grandmas were touched as I told them they were good daughters and good mothers. I would also like to share the story of my patient, Ping. Ping is a 64-year-old lady who suffered from depression for nine years. During the COVID period, she lived alone, had no income, and was socially isolated. She has deteriorating self-care, and for many days, she did not cook one meal and just ate junk food. She was also unable to sleep, despite being on multiple medications. She was invited to join weekly worship with our clinic team, and this was her only social activity in those few months. One morning when I arrived at the clinic, she was there waiting. The first words she said to me were, Doctor, are you disappointed with me? I instinctively replied, No, absolutely not. Why? And she burst into tears. She said she felt very disappointed with herself because of her physical condition, that she was not good and not caring for herself. She even wanted to die. Also, her churchmates said to her that they were disappointed in her because she did not rely on God. We set her down, surrounded her with God's love, and we prayed for her. I felt a touch and invited all to sing an old hymn. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Suddenly, Pain was filled with the Holy Spirit and with joy. She started to sing so loud with an uplifted and free spirit. After the worship, she said she had never sung so joyfully. A week later, Pain came to see me. Her depression was completely gone. She takes care of herself and cooks three meals for herself every day. She is now sleeping well every night. Every time she walks into our clinic, she brings in the sunshine with her bright smile. She dresses herself up nicely. She talks and encourages strangers around her. She prays for other patients in our clinic. And we are so thankful to God for this amazing transformation of a patient who has so little breakthrough in nine years in healthcare, and now we give all glory to Jesus.